we're a wireless company. We own um, wireless infrastructure, towers, and, and, and building systems and DAS networks. And we lease that space back to customers to provide wireless for everyone. We were able to meet our cycle times and, and, and meet our expectations for our customers. We always have been. But we knew that we were putting more work into it than we should. Really being able to, to pick up on, on where we can improve was what I feel like was our, our biggest challenge. Really the optimization is key. You know, on top of everything else that we asked these guys to do, we're saying, hey, every day when you wake up, you've got to spend an hour or two hours figuring out what to do that day. Looking at, a, at your map or knowing in your mind where things are and trying to, to prioritize those. And, and we're taking people away from doing what is valuable work for us, you know, really contributing to, to our success. We really wanted a really smart optimization brain to drive what we do every day. It happened in a matter of a month. You know, it's this, this, this really sharp edge was, was put onto, onto our operation that, um, that we didn't really expect to see that quickly. It's less miles driven, less time spent per task. We were really, really heavily dependent on, on the insight from really just a handful of, of folks at Click. Anytime that there wasn't an easy answer, an easy way to get to where we wanted to be, it was just a couple of phone calls and, and, and bringing somebody else in and tying someone else in to figure out a, another way to work around it. We can't just rest. We can't really be the electric company in the 40s who's just putting up holes and making money. We have to keep innovating and finding new ways to help customers to innovate. Now that we know what the system can do and what it's capable of and, and the value it can bring, it's going to grow as far as our number of users and, and, and the way we implement it and bringing in contractors and all those things.